Is the Jesus that you meet, the Jesus that you want to meet, is an important question for anyone trying to live in response to the Word of God and especially trying to live as an incension. Is the Jesus that you want, the Jesus that you meet? Those who regularly serve amongst the poor will recall Vincent's uh, dictum that we find Christ in the poor. And he was very conscious of how people could be. When he met people who lived in misery, sometimes they were also miserable. They were hard characters. And he told us that we had to love them anyway in, in their hardness of heart, uh, in the fact that sometimes they're not grateful for what we, we do, even though we expect gratefulness somehow. The Feast of the Presentation of the Lord falls on a Sunday this year. This Sunday's feast is another epiphany, another revealing of the Christ, but it's the Christ of St. Luke. And so this piece of the Christmas story um, actually hearkens to the shepherds rather than to the kings, to the poverty of his beginnings and not to the triumph yet to follow. This Christ who will announce himself as the evangelizer of the poor is the fulfillment of who Anna and Simeon awaited. They awaited uh, the one who would deliver them from oppression, who would deliver them from their own poverty. And they waited him for him as the fulfillment of what their hopes had taught them and the hopes of their ancestors had taught them. Their holiness lies in that they were ready to receive the Christ who came in the manner in which he came. And that's the teaching of these scriptures. And so it asks of us a very difficult question. Will we be attuned enough to recognize the Christ when we meet the Christ in the poorest of the poor? It's so difficult sometimes not to describe Christ before we go and look for him in the picture that we've created in our own minds instead of being open to the Christ who will be revealed to us. It asks of us a strong and a searching heart that can look deeply into reality and see the Christ. Let the Christ who is there inform our minds Instead, instead of our minds informing the world how it should conform to our preconceived notions. Servants of the poor listen to the scriptures from the outside in. And that's the word of God for this Sunday and on this feast. That when Christ is presented to us in the person of the poor, will the response be the joy of a Simeon and the happiness to say, now I can go as your servant in peace, for my eyes have seen what I hoped for. Or can I be like Anna and revel in the triumph of God coming in a poor person for her in a poor child? Remember, the Christ of Vincent is the Christ that came to shepherds. The Christ of Vincent is the Christ who comes to us. In every poor person, we have the privilege of serving. Have a beautiful week, and until the next time we meet, may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you.